whether it's chocolate, red hot, sweet tarts, or candy bars, most of us have a favorite confection. June is National Candy Month. And as we get back to the things we love, we have some tips for you on how to celebrate summer with your favorite treats. Carly is joining us right now, spokesperson for the National Confectioners Association. She has some of those tips for us. Welcome, Carly. Thank you so much for having me. And of course, happy National Candy Month. Thank you so much. So first of all, tell us what some of the most popular candies are and flavors heading into the summer. For the summer, Americans tell us that they love chocolate, gummies, and hard candy. And for flavors, fruit flavors are very in for summer. So people are loving strawberry, watermelon, and cherry flavors. So I think it's interesting they're all the red fruits. Okay, so do you have any tips to help us incorporate candy into some of our favorite summer activities? Absolutely. Chocolate and candy can add a little bit of sweetness to really any summer activity that you're doing. So it's a great way to, to bring some sweetness with you if you're going for a hike, if you're going to the pool or to the beach, if you're going to a birthday or graduation party. Treats can add a little bit of sweetness. And um, I know for myself, for example, I love to go to the beach. And 89% of Americans who head to the beach say that they'll be bringing treats along with them. So it's nice to know that when I'm enjoying my peach gummy rings, some other people around me are as well. Awesome. Uh, tell me a little bit about uh, this organization. Uh, it seems pretty sweet. Uh, what do you guys do? We're talking about just candy. Tell me all about that. <laughs> It is a very, very sweet job, I, I will say that. <laughs> um, the National Confectioners Association advocates for America's chocolate and candy companies. So okay. all of those companies and all of the people who make the treats that you know and love and um, all of all of, helping to make sure that all of those treats can make it uh, into stores and into the homes of consumers. So Carly, for people who may be a little skeptical about uh, consuming too much candy, uh, tell us some tips for those people uh, to where they can still enjoy some sweet treats every now and then. It's all about moderation, right? It's absolutely important to figure out how to incorporate chocolate and candy in, into your happy and balanced lifestyle, and it's different for everyone. So if you go to nationalcandymonth.com, you'll find some more resources to help you manage your sugar intake and have some conversations about balance. Um, and it's, again, a great way to incorporate into those outdoor activities. Um, you can look for small pack sizes, mm -hmm. so those little um, 200 calorie or less Packages of chocolate and candy are a great little treat to throw into your bag as you're headed out on your summer adventures. All right, Carly, thank you so much for joining us. If you all would like to see this interview again, you can visit our websites, fox2now.com and kplr11.com and get you some candy, guys.